The Craig Allen Maiden Hurdle is next. Um, this is a three miler. And let's have a look at the field. Goldies at the top for Stu Gray. Reckoner Alex Cherry. Soleil Davril for Obi Wan. Trench Green, Darren Thompson. Daydream Believer, Graham Clisbock. Empress of the World, Joshua Sutherland. Glassy Dolly. Ben Benici. Hackler Omnia. David Robertson. Queen's Lock, David Hooley. San Vina, Craig Beckwith. Track Dan, Leon Van Rensburg, and what on earth is that called? Yika, you kick a moo cow aurora. Oh, that's it, you kick a moo cow aurora. James Shane, thank you very much for that one, James, and away they go. And and, oh, here comes the Scotsman again. I'm going to turn him off. <laughs> Get used to this. Hold on. <laughs> right, there we go. We've now disabled the Scotsman, and we can get back on with the race. And it's Reckoner in the lead from Empress of the World in second, and you kick a moo cow aurora. That one is next. We should get your head round it. It's quite easy to say, isn't it? So anyway, they sort themselves out. They've got 12 flights to take. And over the first flight they go. And what are we thinking of turning professional next week? It's Reckoner in the lead. Well, Trench Green in second. Then Soleil Davril is in third. Your Kikamu Kaurora is fourth. Then Glassy Dolly and Empress of the World with Goldie after that one. But they're sorting themselves out now then and making their way towards the second of the 12 flights and Alex Cherry's Reckoner is in the lead from the first of the two greys, that's Trench Green and the yellow jacketed Soleil Davril on the inside is just about third the Glassy Dolly also close up closest to us is Empress of the World in the black and the red hoops for Joshua sort of looking towards the back Queen's look for David Hooley, just the back marker but they're over flight two now and all still on their feet Going well within themselves and Reckoner reckons to have a lead of about six lengths, I would think, from Trench Green in second. Empress of the World third. Then you kick a moo cow Aurora with Glassy Dolly after that one. And then Goldie, the second of the Greys. They get to flight three. All safely over that one. With Reckoner still in the lead and well clear. Trench Green in second. Empress of the World. And comes track down Leon Van Resburg move through into fourth. With Hackler Omnia after that one, and then Glassy Dolly. You kick a moo cow Aurora next, then San Vina. Queen's look gold is dropped towards the back of the written Soleil Davril is now the back marker, but they're over flight number four. And they've still got the best part of two miles to race. And plenty of time. Those ones towards the back to get into this, and Reckoner is seven clear of Trench Green. It's good to see a few new people in the jumps. A few people who've been around in the past and maybe haven't had jump team before. I remember Ben Benicio in jumps teams before. It's good to see those blue silks going around in the jump races. It's also good to have. Obi Wan at the back there, Sonny Davril. I think, I think our lone American trainer this season, flying the flag and supporting the jump side of the game as well. So that's good. And it's Reckoner that's in the lead, passing the winning post then with a circuit to go. Empress of the World is second. Trench Green is third. Then Hackler Omnia. And then Goldie and Classy Dolly. And uh, then Daydream Believer and Track Down and San Vina. And a bit of a gap to the back three. Queen's Look, Sonny Davril. And your Kikamoo Cow Aurora is now. The back marker. They're racing downhill towards the next, and Reckoner's lead is only three lengths now to Empress of the World in second. Trench Green's been travelling nicely throughout in third. Hackler Omnia has also been running quietly without getting themselves into any problems as they get over number seven, which they're all safely over. And Reckoner leads only by a length and a half now, then to Empress of the World, who's second gap of probably three and a half, four lengths, then to Trench Green, track down on the outside of Hackler Omnia. San Vina is also getting a bit closer and creeping through the field. Queen's looking that purple jacket. Behind that one is Glassy Dolly. And then Goldie with a gap of about four lengths, then to the back to Soleil Davril and your Kikamoo Cow Aurora. But Reckoner, probably only leading by Nick. Empress of the World in second. Field now beginning to bunch in behind. As we get to the business end of the race, over flight number eight they go. 
Uh, reckon they might have just about have been headed there by Empress of the World on the outside. Empress of the World just about in front from Reckoner in second. Then comes Hackler on there, Trench Green track down San Vina, creeping nicely around the outside. Queens looks running into a bit of a brick wall and is going to need a little bit of luck in running there. Daydream Believer is going to try and switch around the outside. Bit of a gap then back to Goldie and Glassy Dolly. Then another gap to Sole Davra and you kick a Moo Cow a roar. Looks like it's out of it. But it's now Reckoner and San Vina. San Vina might just be in the lead now and on the outside. It's San Vina, but now coming between the two of them, it's Hackler Omnia, and it's all changed up the top as now Reckoner tries to fight back on around the outside still. He's Daydream Blue, it's a wide open race. This one has still got the best part of four furlongs to go, and it's Reckoner in the lead from Hacker Omnia, then San Vina, Daydream Believer trying to get back in with his trench green over the third last they go, and Hackler Omnia landed in front. Hackler Omnia in the lead from Reckoner in second, San Vina third, then Daydream Believer, then trench green. Queen's looks now got a bit of a clear run as they race down towards the final two flights then and it's Hackler Omnia on the outside of Reckoner gap of a length and a half then to San Vina in third gap back to Trench Green Queens looks trying to run and surely it's between these front three over the second last good jump by Reckoner on the inside Reckoner gets back into the lead it's Reckoner from Hackler Omnia then a gap of two lengths back to San Vina in third Queens looks still trying to run and they come down towards the final flight Reckoner lands in the lead Reckoner gets away from it well Reckoner looks tough and Reckoner in the lead one last ha attempt from Hackler Omnia to try and close one up towards the line and now Reckoner needs a line Hacker on near oh it's on the nod it's on the nod Reckoner in the lead a stride before the line Reckoner in the lead a stride after the line as well but on the line I wouldn't like to put any money on this because Hacker on near might have just got up and stolen it the heartbreak for Alex Jerry he led a stride before the post and a stride after he got back into the lead again there's a battler and it's a dead heat that's my first dead heat of the season and I'm pretty pleased it's a dead heat as well because Alex Jerry's horse Reckoner did not deserve to lose that so Hackler on there for David Robertson and Reckoner for Alex Cherry will share the spoils in the Craig Allen Maiden San Vina for Craig Beckwith was third Queen's look for David Hooley was fourth and track down for Leon Van Rensburg was fifth